Hello and welcome to another vlog. If you're new here, my name is Faye and I do vlogs every Sunday and then sort of challenges or hauls or sort of chatty sit down ones every other Wednesday. I My camera is still a bit broke so I'm still not sure if I'm properly in shot or not. I think you can just about see my head so we might need to bring it up a bit. This week has not been my fave. I have been feeling pretty flat this week. Things have got on top of me a bit and hormones. But I'm feeling much better now. I've been doing things to try to gene me up a bit. And the fact that there's actually blue skies and sun always makes a difference. This vlog might be a bit strange because, as you know, or as you probably gathered, I tend to film on a Saturday and then behind the scenes I edit it on the Sunday ready for the next week so you are a week behind me but we are due to have snow tomorrow so if we do I'd like to get some footage of that to put into this vlog so I'll do my normal Saturday stuff and then there might be some bonus snow footage at the end but we'll see we'll see how it goes because of the snow I went for a run this morning instead of Sunday so normally I would clean on a Saturday morning run on a Sunday but we've flipped it over this week because I ain't running in no snow but yeah it was cold it hurt my lungs not very good when it's very like very cold it really does hurt more in my chest so that's what we're up to I've got quite a bit of organizing to do and just some bits and bobs in fact I sorted out our food cupboard uh, at some point this week when I took a bit of footage so I'll put that in now and then we'll carry on with everything else that we're doing right I'm gonna go through this cupboard to see what we've got and what we haven't got and whether I need to buy anything to make this better yes I'm in my dressing gown I am dressed I'm just very very cold so let's see what we need to do um, this is the cupboard we're dealing with it's basically where we keep all of our food and washing stuff because there's not a lot of room in this kitchen to put things so let's get the stuff out and then we can see what we've got and what we need We should probably get rid of the treacle. I mean, yeah, it's solid. You can't get the lid off it anymore. I'm doing this on a day before we get our shopping because I think it'll be slightly easier. So that's now clear. So, looks like the main thing in this cupboard is like pasta and noodles and bits like that. So what is the best way of organising this? That is the core. Right, now let's put the washing stuff back in because we know where that goes. That's the only place that can go. So what I'm thinking is I might change this up. That will confuse Pete though. What we right, so I've now sorted out the cupboard. Ooh. I don't know if it's gonna stay like this. Well, it won't stay like this because it never does. But we should get our shopping in a couple of days' time so we can see if it works as it is. So we've now got. Our washing stuff stayed the same place. I've now put all the rice, pasta, risotto rice, couscous, all of that is in this bottom half here. Um, now all with the clips because they didn't all have that. And then we've got jars and sauces and tins this side, packets, miscellaneous, cereal and then hot chocolate at the back because we don't use that bit quite as often. So 
we shall see if that that works and that stays or whether we need to buy some sort of storage to go in here um because that's that one the other cupboard i want to do is this one with all the pans but i can't face it and i i definitely need some help with that one so pete will have to join me to do that so my birthday is next week towards the end of the work week and i asked pete if he could get me a birthday cake but he's being like awesome and is going to attempt to make me a birthday cake which i'm very excited about pre planning as well you know it's it's not till thursday i'm doing it now because it's the time i got to it i mean i don't know how we're going to store said cake until thursday but well we might just eat it beforehand as well but then it's not my birthday cake well, I, I mean, don't know. I mean, well, you, did, well, so. you did go to Sainsbury's, you could have just bought a birthday cake. Well, what's that make it? The effort, it's the effort, isn't it? <laughs> that's, the, that's what matters. I and I asked him just now whether he's ever made a cake by himself. I think I have, but I'm not totally sure. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not. So, this I'm very excited about, but I'm here to. Uh, let him know which things I can't do it to too use. good, otherwise she's going to say that she, I need to be making the cakes in the future, not her. So. No, because I actually enjoy making the cakes. So that's... So I need to make it worse than Faye makes it, just to make her feel good. Just to make me feel better. The, yeah. the apron's there. Will I get my star maker for the apron? Yeah. Sure. It's got chocolate on it already, so you're fine. It just shows that I'm a, I'm a, I'm a veteran chef. A veteran baker, shall I? Okay. Um, excuse the washing machine. And then, um, do you want to know what else do you want to know? Doesn't really fit me. Well, make it bigger or something. I can't make it bigger. You can. That's on a, one of these things. Yeah. So if you go the other side, then you can make the neck thing bigger. But then you'll have to put it back. So yeah, I'll leave this one. What are you saying, Zoe? What else do you want to know to use? Just that whisk, and that's it. Isn't it? Do you want to know tins to put it in? Yeah. We've got, two some, tins. we've got some pink silicone. I can't do that. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, it's already going really well. It is. That's what? There's some pink silicone round. These ones, yeah. Oh wait, the pink ones are the, 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 the these ones. Well, the, you could use either. We've pink got. But those ones. Um, Where's the other one? In there somewhere. You might need a bit of a rinse out though, where it's been. Anything else? No. no. I'll leave you to it then. Enjoy. Thank you. Have fun. Yeah, so bless Pete for making me a cake. Um, he's obviously seen me being a bit down this week and part of that is because my birthday is next week. I am turning 30 so it is quite a big one. You know, anything with a zero is always a big birthday. And obviously we're in lockdown so Anything that I'd originally thought about or wanted to do, I can't. I can't go and see people. I have organised a few like Zoom stuff, but it's not the same, is it? So I think he's seen that and has he's got on board with trying to make it as special as we possibly can. But yeah, you'll see next week because next week's vlog will be my birthday. But yeah, I bought a new curling wand in the black friday sales so i think i'm gonna try for the first time to go and use that so i'll take you with me we'll show you and we'll do all of that because why the hell not oh talking of organization um i bought some material baskets to put all my nail varnishes in because i was getting really oh, i can't work out the angle because i was getting really fed up of them falling off the thing all the time so that's one of the organizations that we've done but right let's go do something with my hair if i thought about it i should have brought the ring light in but i haven't done so we're gonna cope with the dinge so i don't know if you follow the similar people to me on instagram but a lot of them are doing adverts for that bondi boost wand which looks really simple and i thought that I might want to try it out. But then I looked at the price 
of the Bondi Boost wand and realised, no, I didn't want to try it out because it's so expensive. So I did a little Amazon, you know, wander to see if I could find something similar for less money and I came to this one. I don't know if you can see that. The Pictoon Professional, Professional Hair Curler. So it looks, in terms of barrels and stuff, exactly the same to the Bondo Boost. But I haven't actually tried this out despite having it now for about two months. So we'll give it a go and see what we what we think. Right, I had to get my hair brushed so I got the, the ring light as well. Whoa, Jeff. Careful, move out of the way. Can you go up there on the chaise lounge? Yeah, so I got the ring light anyway. Um, oh dear, if you could... Look, this is what I'm dealing with. Because there's a plug socket just between the wall and the bookcase. But Pete stores his tennis rackets there, so I've just had to pull them all out. So this is what I'm dealing with because... There's the mirror, the only full length mirror we have in this house. Um, but yeah, so I've got the ring light, give us a bit, a bit better lighting. Um, and then this is the, the wand. As I said, I haven't used this yet. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's give this a whirl, shall we? This could go really wrong. I don't normally do things like this. But there we go. Ooh. I'll stay up, probably not. I'm quite scared about burning myself, to be quite honest. Oh my god, the heat coming off that. Don't want to touch it. Sorry, that hasn't done anything. I think maybe we need less hair in it. Let's try less hair in it. That's a bit better. I don't know whether I'm just making myself look a bit like Hagrid. It's not good look, is it? It was the first try. Some of it worked, some of it didn't. We'll keep practicing and we'll see what happens. Right, I bought this thing in the hope that it's going to help us with. The horrible cupboard of pans. So Pete's finished his cake. Did you have fun? I'm sorry, AJ. Yeah. <laughs> Took a while, hour and a half, but like, yeah. but it all cleaned up as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah, now I need to put this together and see if it actually works for our horrible, horrible pan cupboard. So that was a big old fail. Doesn't fit in the cupboard. No, our cupboard is a nightmare to be fair. Yeah. It is the worst cupboard ever. We, yeah, I know, Jeff. We do have a strange layout of the kitchen. Um, but that cupboard is just particularly bad because it goes all the way along the countertop. So everything just gets stuck. And then it's 
just awkward, isn't it, Jeffy? It's just awkward, buddy. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Didn't see my mouth, it was Jeff. But... <laughs> right. I don't know what I'm going to do now. I'm going to finish reading my book. Excuse the red face if you can see it within the dull light. But I'm so excited. So we've ordered a takeaway for dinner tonight. And I have been truly suckered in by the adverts because I've seen so many of them for this place. And we have a Nando's coming. Yeah. I realised on our walk with Jeff a moment ago who is here. Who? That the last Nando's I had was like the week before lockdown when me and Pete had our holiday at home thing. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up up the top. We went to the Harry Potter studios and stuff like that. It's worth, it's worth watching. Really excited. They've obviously got limited menus, so it's not quite my usual, usual dish, but I haven't had Nando's in ages. I just really, really fancied one. So that's what we're doing. I'm just waiting for it to arrive. Boom. The next day. Snow started. Pete showing Jeff the snow. Jeff. Hello, buddy. Is it snowing? We're going to go and play in there soon. So, from when I first took the clip, it's been about an hour and a half, maybe. Um, so here's the view, one of our neighbours has built a pretty impressive snowman in this time too and uh, me and Pete and I are going to go off with Jeff have our own little play, we're going to take a GoPro with us and I've never used the GoPro in my vlogs so I don't know what the quality of the filming is like but I'll be interested to see myself actually but we'll add in our GoPro footage now after the snowman obviously so there you go. I don't know if you can see that through our window. But I think it's pretty impressive. They whip that one up pretty quickly. Take him off, Jeff. So take him off, take excited. Him. Jeff. Wait. Wait. Wait, Jeff. It doesn't look very white. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> Disappears, Jeff. Love the crunch on the. Come on, Jeffy. Can't see this <laughs> Where's he gone, Jeff? It's my magic. <laughs> I must admit, this is a nice change to uh, a lockdown. That's why I actually wanted snow today. I don't normally like it. There are some people up there, aren't there? We, just, we, we go here if you want, let's go. Yeah. Yellow, snow. yellow snow. Don't eat yellow snow yet. <laughs> Trying to, uh... It's like a huge tennis ball, Jeff. This is Jeff. <laughs> Where'd it go? You having fun, Pete? Yeah. 
I think we're making this way, man. I think we're making this. I don't know. Can't really say I'm doing anything right now. Come join in, make your own then. No, I'm quite happy. Okay. Me and Jeff, we've worked very hard on this. Hey. Okay, face out. You want to put your names in this as well? I did the headdress. It's <laughs> yeah, the best bit. Ba -ba. Detail is extraordinary. With Donnie Darko style smile and very round to square to not any shape body. What, what do you think? For headdress. I mean, the headdress is pretty good. Jeff is very excited there. Pose, Jeff. Pose. Thumbnail. <laughs> right, so we've had our fun in the snow. Um, we're now back and warming up and you know, like that. Excuse the washing machine as always. Um, I mean, it's still going, it's still snowing, so. Uh, see what happens later but because of that this vlog has turned out quite long so I'm gonna end it here so if you've enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you haven't please go ahead and subscribe um, as next week is my birthday and I'll see you for that video next week bye